Hey Chosen One, welcome back to my channel. So it's Anushka Bure, I'm a prophetess for the most high and I post Christian content for the Chosen Ones. We're talking about in this video how you need to call on God and you should not give up the fight. I don't know what you're going through, okay? Last night, this morning, what's coming up for you in this coming day because we don't know what's going to come our way. The Lord Jesus said, uh, worry not about tomorrow. We have enough to deal with for today. And God is saying to someone today, call on his name, call out and cry out to him. And if you have been, he has heard you and his eye is upon you because it says in the word of God, his eye is upon the righteous and the righteous shall never be moved nor forsaken. Okay. And many are the afflictions. Many are the afflictions of the righteous. It doesn't say, you know, a few afflictions will come. It says there will be many, but then it says in the Psalms that we shall be delivered out of them all. Not a few, but out of them all. Okay. So whatever you're going through is guaranteed that you're going to be delivered from it is guaranteed because he is a deliverer and Jesus came to set the captives free so I don't know what kind of captivity you might be in I don't know what kind of battle you might be in but it's not too big for the God that I serve it's not too big for the God that you serve we serve a mighty and we serve a living God and he is an invisible God remember that as well child of God the Holy Spirit is saying remember he is invisible so he can manifest himself and he will manifest himself but he also so operates in the realm of the invisible he is undetectable you know we pray to an undetectable invisible god and it's until you have that revelation or encounter or manifestation of him you know that can really strengthen your faith because sometimes we have to just keep having faith even when we don't see a way out even when we don't know what's going to hit us next we don't know which way the enemy is going to come right because the enemy can come in like a flood but guess what the lord will rise up a standard up against him okay the lord will show up and show out against him look what he did in exodus with the the mighty plagues that he sent on his enemies let god arise and his enemies be scattered amen because we can't fight this fight alone we need god I know I need God. We need God in our lives. We need him on our side. We need to be in right standing with him. We need to try the very best we can with the strength and the grace that he's given us this day. Okay. And remember, always say, you know, if you have plans or anything, always say if the Lord wills it. Because, um, you know, man makes plans in his heart, but the Lord establishes his steps as Proverbs says. So yeah, don't give up this fight. Um, God wants you to keep fighting. I don't know what you're fighting. Some kind of, I'm hearing in my spirit, Leviathan spirit. You could be fighting, you know, spiritual wickedness in high places. Um, don't give up this fight. Don't give up the battle because it's just begun and you're about to win it. You're about to have victory in Christ Jesus. As long as you don't give up the fight, don't put down your sword of the spirit. Don't put down any of the full armor of God. Um, you are in this until the end because it says those who endure until the end, the same shall be saved. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And thank you for watching this video. I hope it's encouraged you. It's a short one today. Um, if you like this content, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.